What's up world? Steve over here at Sobel Sounds. I want to show you guys a little tip that I do to my speakers when I'm trying to get the most bass response out of them. So when you think of subwoofers and you think of the enclosures, what's one of the key things a lot of people think about is you got to have a strong enclosure because you don't want the enclosure to flex because you won't get good bass response. So kind of think of that with the speakers too. You know, the speakers have a frame to them that will flex once there's a lot of power and it's trying to play a lot of bass. So what I do is I take my little sound editing scraps and I put it on pieces of the frame to prevent that from flexing and it actually helps a little bit with bass response. So check this out. So this here is our hybrid audio Imagine Series power sports speaker. So what I do with my sound deadening is I make little small strips and I apply it to the flat parts of the frame. Okay, I've already done it to these two over here. So you'll see it applied here and here. Now I'm not blocking these holes because we do need to make sure that the heat comes out of the voice coil when it's playing. But just on these flat spots right here on the outside, put these on the speakers uh, just to help a little bit with bass response you know anything that's not flexing and making mechanical noise is going to make sound so the stronger the frame the stronger the enclosure which we've already sound deadened this is going to a jeep wrangler so the more sound deadening and the stronger the structure is the better your bass performance will be so i hope this tip helps you out